Play the transition. Hello? Yo. What's going on, Frosty? What's going on, man? Nothing chilling, man. What's going on? Talk to me, man. What you got going on? What you was what's what's called? Uh, Headache. I just need like some I just need some guidance, man. I just need All some right, guidance. I got you. Talk to me. So look. I took Shorty right. Mm -hmm. Like this little this little this little I don't know if I call it a date, right? Okay. Realistically, I'm bad at uh reading songs, you know. I'm not a good you song don't, reader. You don't understand how to uh read like yeah i get what you're saying continue you feel me like she not my girl realistically you know what i'm saying we ain't put a label on it mm -hmm. i just want to know if i'm doing the right thing is she feeling me or not okay all right all right so i took her to my job i work at like this ice cream place all right yeah, i took her to your work ice cream. Okay. Yeah. And uh, we just really just chatted it up, you know. She was laughing, having a good time. Beating the donies down. The beating like, like the let me describe it for you, right? Right. She like five foot. Elijah Mini joined Dollar Count. Latina. All right. Yeah. She telling me that she a party type of girl. Okay. Are you black? Like yeah. Okay, I'm listening. Right, 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 right. Now, me, I'm an athlete, so. And to tell you the truth, I ain't got no motion like that, bro. What sports you play? I play football. Are you a starter? Nah, I'm too short. How tall are you? I'm 5'3". How old are you? I'm 17. <sighs> hey, look, I want to be a nurse, man. I already, I already came to the realization. You got some time. You got like four years. But, um. Dr. said I ain't growing no more, man. I ain't gonna lie. Stretch a lot. Like, that's my. Stretch, stretch a ton, bro. You could really stretch out yourself another two inches, bro. But you got to stretch, like, every day. Stretch, spread out your limbs, you feel me? But 5'3", damn, that's a terrible luck of the draw. But anyways, back to your girl. So, you 5'3", you play football. So, like, you one of them bench-warming niggas. Like, you don't get no PT. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I be, I still be, you know, putting my, my work in in the gym. Okay, you feel I feel that, but like you don't get no PT. Like you don't make a difference on the football team. You're nah. just you're just a filler character type shit. Nah, but like my skills is there though. I like, mean, hand me the ball. You know what I'm saying? But how often speed. do they hand you the ball? Not at all. Okay, <laughs> all right. So let's get let's get past the fucking you know what I mean? extra shit and let's just be real. So five three, well fit, bench yeah. warmer on the football team. And you talking to this girl. Now, let me ask you, how, like, how much do y'all talk? I ain't gonna lie. I, like, seriously started talking to her, like, two weeks ago. How long have y'all, like, been flirting? Let's say that. Flirting? It's like, I don't know. Like, I really feel like I'm reading the situation wrong. It's either that or she just, like, a real, what's the word? Pure? Nah, I don't wait, think it's wait, pure. wait, wait. Okay, okay, okay. Like, like she just real. Okay, so look, better question. When y'all conversate, yeah. what is the conversation like? Like, are do you feel like you're pressing for her to respond to you? You're pressing. Nah, for her to like... she, she be talking like the conversation be flowing. Okay. It's just like when I, I be hesitant to start flirting because she, she's not really a. I don't want to say that type of girl. She's like more pure hearted, I say. So like, I feel wrong. You feel wrong? You know? oh, like, wrong. okay, all right. What do you mean she's like, pure hearted? Like she's like, innocent? She just, like she doesn't yeah, like... 
Yeah. Like she doesn't that's talk. Cool. Like what? Give me. Have you ever tried to flirt with her? Yeah, I'll be What's like, Alexis? I'll be little, hints. little little hints, you know, little little jabs. I'll be throwing them in there. Okay, so you give me an example me? of a time you tried to flirt with her and how it went. Like one time I was talking to her. I forgot what it was. She like she said something about her being a good girl. I was like, "Oh, you a good girl." And then it's like she just started laughing. But like, you know when girls do that laugh when they cover their mouth? She wait. She said she's a good girl. And, and then said, started well, giggling. Yeah. Like what I mean. You I asked, up. wait, what did you say to her that made her trip? Like it was like last week, bro. What'd like, you say though? I was in my nursing class and then she was saying something. I was like, she was like, I don't even remember, bro. It was something along the line, like she did some like bad shit. I was like, I didn't even know he was like that for real. She like What bad shit did oh. she do? Bro, it's like it's not memorable. But I just remember that part of the conversation. Okay, so give me like you gotta give me context though, because I'm trying to help you. What was the bad shit like? Was it like she broke something? She like like Cause she liked to party a lot, right? She told me that she liked to party okay, a lot. So I think off rip, cool. let me tell you, no good girl, no innocent woman likes to party a lot. Let's just cut that out there. You feel me? She's uh, not innocent. Cause if she parties a lot, that means she's drinking or smoking. Or she told me straight up that she don't drink or smoke. Like like she stays away from all that. Which like I don't. But I don't she parties a lot. That. She parties like she don't, goes to King Saves. Oh, like family parties. Nah, like, random people's kink says, like, her friends, they be invite her to, like, kink says, and, like, every weekend, she be out partying, dancing. She says she loves to dance. Okay, she loves to dance, she loves to party. Five foot Latina. Um, now, let me ask you this. Yeah. Have you ever spoken to her sexually? Nah, bro. Has she ever made joke or light of like sexual experiences or anything? Nah, I don't think. I think she a V, bro. That's how I'm, I'm feeling. Okay. So then, like, I was her. She was talking about like she a Christian and like how she be going to church and how she misses her church. I'm like. Ain't nobody just bring up their church randomly and then start talking about it. You feel me? I feel you. Um. All right, let's do something here. Because there's only one way to get this out. You like this girl? Yeah. All right, you call her. Right now? Yeah. Like. Are you on your phone? You're not on your phone. Yeah, I'm on my phone. Oh, you are on your phone. Damn, niggas don't be having computers no more. Yeah, I don't got All right, phone. so look, text her. Yeah. And say these exact words. Take like, get ready to type. You listening? All right, I'm ready. Be like, hey, I know you like not used to this type of approach, but I'm kind of feeling you, and I understand that you be on your innocent church shit but i really would like to get to know you better in a romantic sense can i take you out sometime and that's all you have to do and then hit send and see what she says simple all right then bro all right have you been uh, texting her at all today yeah like today i took her to the uh ice cream place and chatted it up so you took her uh, so so i got her some flowers too I just want to know if I'm like reading shit right. You hear me? When you gave her the flowers, what did she say? She's like, you so dumb. I fucked up. Well, be honest with me, gang. Let's just see what she says first. I All really right. wish you could call her because that'd make this simpler. You don't have like a iPad or something that you could join back on? 
Uh, a lot of niggas is going through some rough times, man. I feel it. I feel it. I feel it. Um. Damn. All right. Well, we just gotta wait for her text. But um, I'm gonna be honest with you, cuz it seems to me like you're a friend more than a lover, and yeah. it seems like she just only views you as a friend. Cause I'm gonna tell you why. When you when she said that innocent shit, covered her mouth and laughed. That was it right there. That should have told you everything. That bitch be on some shit. Like that. And I love when women bring up their religion and their church because for the right nigga, that shit don't mean nothing, bro. You feel me? Like, granted, I respect their uh, decision to follow Christ and try to be a better person, but go hoes be going. She be party. She likes to party a lot. That means she's she's an adrenaline junkie. She likes excitement. She likes being turned up. And I ain't gonna lie to you, five foot Latina and seventeen. That's the prime of her life. Seventeen to twenty three. That's when her prime is. You feel me? So she yeah. might be going, twin. I ain't gonna lie to you. She might be going, but that's a might. You feel that's me? A might. There's always a chance that what she's saying is fact, and she could just be somebody who enjoys parties but is wholesome. That too. But odds more likely than not is that she's going. But we'll see what she's saying. Um, giving her flowers was kind of crazy. Uh, well, did you spend money on flowers? She was like $4. All right, $4. And then her response was, you so dumb. She covered her mouth and laughed, didn't she? Yeah. Yeah, bro. It, it's not here. I ain't gonna lie. You might have to pack it up. You might have to pack it up. Wait, niggas don't be doing flowers no more? Niggas do do flowers, but you do flowers for bitches that you confirm you fuck with already. Like, mm. you can't... Giving, giving, giving flowers to a woman that hasn't even confirmed that you're a potential suitor is crazy work, gang. You feel me? That's your facts. Glock. $4, that's a large fries right there, bro. You could have ate. You could have fed the gang with that $4. Um... But it's okay, you know? We learn from these mistakes, and we get better, and we improve because of them. Um, so, like I said, when she texts you back, niggas need to know what she said. How long, uh, does, how long does it usually take her to text you back? Not that long. She usually answers right away, but she might be asleep. When was the last time she texted you? Uh, like, right after I dropped her off, which was, like, around 5. Yeah, 5 o'clock. What was the last then, thing she uh, said to you? I'm outside. After you dropped her off, she didn't respond? No. Nah. I think she sent that, like, as I was pulling up. And then I didn't text her back. Like, after I dropped her off, I came home at 8 and took a nap. And then kind of got up to watch her stream. So she didn't say thank you for taking me to get ice cream, nothing. Like, I had fun. I'm glad you went. None of that? I mean, she said that to me before she left. So, like, I don't Okay. That like a, okay. No, that's that's solid. That's solid. That's solid. That means she's appreciative. That means she respects you a little bit, at least. You feel me? So it's not totally <laughs> good. Um, damn, I like I wish you could FaceTime her. Damn. Or like call her or something. Hey, we'll see. hey, look. Yeah. Leave the call. Call her, right. FaceTime her, and like just ask her, like, yo, straight up, I like you. I'm like I know we're we've been like civil and cordial for low, but I really want to like give this a chance because I fuck with you for real. And then tell me, come back and tell me what she says. We'll be here waiting for you. All right, best, best, I got you. All right, bet. <sighs> Yo, hello, Javar. What's, what's going good? On? What's going on? What's good, bro? How you doing? I'm chilling. You know that, man. Always chilling. What's up with you? That's good, dude. I'm chilling, too. We both chilling, bro. It's a chill night, bro. It is a chill night, bro. What you got going on? <laughs> um, It's going to sound corny or whatever, bro. But, you know, this is a safe place. You know, I'm here with my, my favorite streamers, you know, Scum TK. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, Basically... I feel like I have like a uh like a shriek. I like I like I like to pretend like I'm a streamer. Like when I go to school and stuff, like I act like a Twitch streamer. Like like I act like I seen that. I'll be acting like rage and stuff and it's like What do you mean acting? You know like, I, like you, you pretend to have their personality. Okay, like alright, so right so like when I come into like when I come into the school building, right? 
I be walking like I'm doing Dennis and stuff in LA. And then I see somebody like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I, I don't know, man. It's like, I, I just can't stop. It's like, it's natural. It's like, it naturally happens. So what you're saying is you're, you're role playing their personalities? Yeah, it's like, it's like I don't have my own. It's like I'm copying, like, other people. Like Twitch. Yeah, bro. That's what I'm trying to say. All right. So yep. I'm, I'm, what I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you two things. First and foremost, you're not that weird, bro. A lot of niggas, you're not the only nigga in the world who copies niggas' personalities or have gained personalities based on the people that they watch. Majority niggas do that shit. Okay. Um, I'm not going to sit here and pretend or belittle you and make it seem like you're weird and awkward. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I ain't going to lie to you. You feel me? It's okay to take small things from other people, but pretending to be them niggas, kind of crazy. But you're not the only nigga that's doing that, all right? There's a plethora, a million plus niggas whose personalities are based off of who they watch on YouTube, Twitch, and the internet, all right? So don't feel bad for that. Now, on the topics of you doing that shit, it's not, there's nothing wrong with like, picking up traits and like positive attributes that these niggas have like maybe duke's confidence or kai's ability to step out into a crowd and be funny and be confident and you feel me and that's cool but you shouldn't let the internet shape who you are you should find that out for yourself how old are you me uh 15 see you young and impressionable bro you don't have to be you don't have to be your full f version of yourself yet trust me when i was 15 i didn't know who i was either I, I was like a hooping nigga. I was an anime watcher. I was embarrassed to be an anime watcher because back in 20 fucking, what, 2011, 2012, believe. when niggas watched anime, you was a fucking weeb. You was a loser. So I was, I was one of those, I was the OG niggas who like hid anime and like watched it. Like, you feel me? So niggas saying, oh my God, get off my dick, bro. TK, TK, I got a question, right? All right, I got an answer. What's up? You know, you watch, so you watch like anime and stuff, right? Uh -huh. And like, you were smaller than like now you is, right? So like, did you get like shoved in lockers? I've never been shoved in a locker a day in my life. See, that's the misconception. I watched anime, but I wasn't a loser. Like, I played basketball. I was cool with all the niggas. Everybody, like, I was that one nigga that niggas liked. Like, you know that token black guy in white people movies? Like, yeah, I mean, like yeah. they go to parties and he's there, but he's you not sure? like in the, in the, in the, yeah, I'm positive. I was cool. Yeah. I played varsity basketball. I played lacrosse. Varsity. I played sports. You feel me? I was, I was, yeah, I mean, I was cool you, people. You played varsity? Yeah, I played varsity, bro. TK, you did not play varsity, bro. I don't know what I'd have to lie <laughs> about, but uh, yeah, there's facts that I played varsity. You know what I mean? My fault. I shouldn't laugh at that. Look, the other one, I played. I appreciate it though, though. That's real stuff. Like, you know, like, like, I don't know. I gotta stop, like, deepening my voice on stuff. Like, you be I, like, I don't know. Voice? I just, like, it's, you know, like, I be like, I be like, I, like, I talk to somebody, be like, hey, how you doing? Like, nah, I just start see, talking like that. That's bro. some loser shit. Stop doing that, bro. Just be yourself. Okay, you don't gotta say it like that, though. No, but I'm telling you, I'm gonna be real with you. That's some loser shit. Stop doing that. Like, that's some loser how? shit. How? Cause you're, yeah, you know, again, nigga, that's not who you are. Just talk normal. Why the fuck are you pretending to be this deep voice, pop smoke ass nigga? Just be your normal self, bro. Because you got to understand that when you do shit like that for attention and you do shit like that, the people that you're getting attention from are authentically fucking with you. They're fucking with the fake version of you. And you never want people who fuck with a fake version of yourself. You want people who fuck with the real you. You know what I mean? That's just better than any phony, fake amount of clout or attention you get from this weird ass internet niche personality you're doing. Okay, you so I'm supposed to raise the raise the girls then. By being yourself. Why would you want bitches that fuck Bro. with you for who aren't who you aren't? Cause I'm telling Cause you, you're gonna be you... out here faking a personality in the moment that you try to like be real with her, she gonna call you a loser. But TK, shouldn't it make you kinda like somewhat happy because like sometimes I be I be pretending to be you because you like short and stuff. So why not? Because I'm me and you are you. You're special as yourself. There is not a single person in the world who is you. And that in itself is a special trait. God made you unique TK. and you for a reason. Stop trying to be other niggas, bro. But TK, you like, I'm not going to care. You want to look the coolest dude. So that, like, you I appreciate that. I appreciate that. I thank you very much for finding me cool, funny, or whatever. But I'm telling you, you're one of the coolest niggas on the internet. Oh, real life groupie, pause, pause on that though. 
You feel me? So, so what you're saying is you're a real life like dick rider, like you're a glazer. I mean, what you you just said, honesty is the best policy, right? Yeah, honesty is the best policy. So, why would I not accept it? Okay, it's okay to accept it, but you shouldn't like continue to do it. Stop dick riding, bro. Be yourself, okay? Man, that's like lame, though. Know? It's not lame. All I do is actually. Being a dick rider and being a groupie and being a nigga whose personality is created based off of who you watch on the internet is kind of lame because you're not an authentic person. Because the moment, you feel me, God forbid, any one of your favorite streamers get canceled or is no longer cool, what are you going to do? I'm canceled then too. I'm canceled. I respect it. It takes real cojones to dick ride this much. Like, you get canceled. I'm canceled with you, like. I we both are like the same people. I appreciate the love. Even though I'm taller than you, but we still the same people. Well, but look, I got a question. I got one last question. I ain't uh, trying to be in uh, here too long. No problem. Even though you really don't got nothing, but um, when you doing another like uh viewer like Ox battle with like they all music, cause I've been cooking up some heat, bro. I got you. I'll do some. We'll set some shit you know up. See, the last time wait, I was doing it, I got flame. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Huh? You know what's crazy? That's your own personality. Nigga, you make music. That's something that you should stand on, bro. My music go hard, bro. Exactly. That's your personality. You invested into music. You like the arts. Why are you like trying to be other niggas when you already cool doing some cool shit? Yo, Drake did like one of my songs, so yeah, that's true. All right. I've heard enough lies. <laughs> okay, but like when you. Niggas just being that bitch lying. Yo. Yo. Yellow. Yo, the lady. Hello. What's up, bro? Yeah, what's up? All right, so. It's this, um. It's this girl. Mm-hmm. I used to mm-hmm. talk to. Well, not really talk to, but like we still talk. But like I used to have feelings for her. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So we went through DMT together because we both in the military, and we got stationed to the same base and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So she started. Um, she started talking to this one dude, and she like constantly tell me about him and stuff like that. How she he would treat her bad and all that. And I was like, well, you need to like stop talking to him, stuff like that. Find somebody better. So that can, you know, uh, so you can come better in life because it was starting to fuck with her mentally. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But at the same time, you're telling her this, I was slowly starting to catch feelings for her. And All right, let me stop you right there. Before we continue, okay. we're not pillow talking ass niggas. Don't ever downplay or diss a nigga to gain preferential, preferential uh, feelings towards a woman. All right. Let that let that young lady fall or stand on her own you could give her advice if she asked for it but don't never be that saucy santana nigga in her ear mm, girl you do it for serve so much better than him he ain't even like that's not gonna get you no pussy bro all right now if she came to you and was like yo this happened whoop de whoop give her a straight up answer yo cool whatever whatever but let her know that like i'm not your friend i'm trying to fuck always because now you're you're misleading her and she thinks she's trusting a homie when really she's trusting a nigga that wants some pussy but just too afraid to be real with her but continue no okay so i didn't want to cut you off but like it's not really like a wanted pussy thing like i was like actually trying to get with her because she was like a real cool person Mm -hmm. but i wanted them to have their relationship because i'm not the type to be a homewrecker if you work out you work out if you don't then i'm sorry for that so I'm going to tell you this right Hold on. Listen, nigga. As a man, if you want something, you go after it. I don't care what walls or obstacles are in your way. Because if, if it was meant to be, that bitch would choose up on him. And if she choose, she going to choose you. You feel me? Sometimes closed mouths don't get fed. You know what I mean? It sound like yeah. you're scared to take a chance in a, in a fear of rejection. But... Now, if you take that chance and say she do reject you, once she break up with the nigga, she might slide back. Mm. Type shit. But if you 
keep up this little facade of like, oh, we're just cool. Whoop de whoop. I'm waiting my turn. You're not winning, bro, because you're only building up this idea that she's you're somebody she's can trust and you're her friend and her homie and you'll be locked into that position. You know what mm. I mean? Yeah. It's cool. You know what I mean? But it's better to be real with her and let her know, hey man, you got a nigga, baby, but that ain't never stopped me. A test, and you feel me? I cheat on all my tests. You know what I'm saying? Teacher being there ain't never stopped me. A nigga closing out on my jump shot ain't gonna stop me from shooting. You know what I mean? So let her know that, bro. And if she's like, oh, well, I got something going on, we'll be like, all right, cool. I'm glad for you. Hit me when that shit's over. Because mm-hmm. I'm not a therapist, bitch. I'm not here to hear your problems. I'm not here to listen to your qualms, your issues. Fuck, I don't wanna hear about how that nigga be doing you dirty for. You still fuck the nigga, right? She still fucking him, ain't it? No, they stop talking. Okay, like so, then, so, so, so then, so what's the problem, nigga? Tell her what's up. No, here's the thing, though. So, when I, this was like, say this was like some, probably like two or three months ago, because mm-hmm. she ended up getting deployed. She's, she's out of the country right now. So, you know that blah, military blah, blah. bitches be fucking, right? Oh, yeah, most definitely. Okay, continue. So, she went out. And when she went out, that's when I decided to start talking to a couple of females, blah, 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 going around and stuff to like boost my confidence and, you know, start fucking with them, blah, blah, blah. Cause I'm, I'm 19 at the moment. So I'm not at that point of life. Where I'm like ready to like actually settle down, get married, have kids, all that stuff. I'm still trying to explore and all that stuff. Yeah. So I'm doing all this and say about like two or three days ago, she just randomly texted me, asked me how I'm doing. And so we just chatted up, getting to, uh, getting asking how each other are and stuff. And then she hit me with the, so do you talk to anyone question? And what did you say? I haven't responded to it. I just left it on red. Nigga, are you afraid to be like, yeah? No, I'm not afraid to, but like, she, some of the people that I am talking to, she, she knows that. So, so she then could, she knows you're talking to somebody. Kind of, yeah. So then tell her straight up. Y'all talk to a couple people. What's up? Uh, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Nigga, are you afraid to stand on business, nigga? No, no. Stand, stand, on, business, stand on business, nigga. Yeah, I talk to some people, bro. Like, what? That ain't your bitch. All that's going to happen is she going to want you more. Yeah, I got a few people I'm talking to. I'm dealing with. What's up? What you need? Oh, uh, here's what, exactly how the conversation going to go. Oh, I, I just kind of miss you. But if you got hoes... And I guess I'll go my way. Be like, all right, be safe. And leave it at that. And then she going to hit you back on some, oh, whoop de whoop de whoop You ain't got time for me. Like, bro, you got to understand. Women want what they cannot have, bro. No bitch want a nigga who don't get no bitches. Women are competitive creatures. You wonder why a nigga get a girlfriend and then all of a sudden all the hoes want to fuck with a nigga? Why do women like married men so much? Because... He's he gives them he he's the representation of something they cannot have. So you talking to bitches, that's cool. Stand ten toes on that, bro. It ain't gonna do nothing but make her feel like, oh my god, he doesn't want me anymore. I'm not the most important thing in his life anymore. Boom. You're right. You're right. She's not even in the country, nigga. Even if he wasn't talking to nobody, what she gonna fly back to see you? What y'all gonna do long distance? Fall in love fairy tale shit? No, nigga. Stop being scared to let that nigga woman. Whoa, I said nigga. Stop being scared to let that woman know. Uh, you 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 doing what you doing, bro? All right. All right. All right. Thank you, bro. Appreciate you it. You I got in life. You young, balling. Don't be afraid to let her know you getting bitches. How long did you have her on read? Read for read. Uh, three days. At this point, don't even respond. <laughs> she gonna text you again. I, I, but 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 um, I'm gonna head out. But before I go, you want twenty or fifty subs? Let me get a little fifty. All right, I got you, twin. Bless up. Appreciate. Appreciate you. for that advice. Of yes, course, sir. of course. Let me get like fifty. Bobby, Clamp, Lance. What leg you want to talk about? Yo, open a terrace with the.
big 50 gifted. You gotta get this up for my nigga Oprah Taylor. Hit her in a whisper, say, damn, he popped for that nigga, my nigga, father. Nah, that's fine though. Appreciate the 50 gifted, nigga. Lele. A Lele. 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 What's up? What's going on? Lissis. Lele, I ain't gonna lie. Next time, I huh. see, next time I see you talking like that in my chat, I'm taking my belt off. I'm not playing with you, bro. <laughs> I have some fucking decorum in my chat, okay? Sorry. What you need advice <laughs> about now, though? I'm having nigga problems, TK. Shit getting the same, bro. Okay. I'm, I'm listening. Talk to me. All right. So, it was one good day out here. Wait, let me see what day it was. Hold on. Okay. Go back. Get the messages. You beat on niggas, Lay? Tell the truth. <laughs> no, I was in middle school. <laughs> okay. That's crazy. All right, hold on. Let me see. <laughs> okay, so this was October the 10th. It's a new month now, but, mm -hmm. you know, it still happened. Mm -hmm. So anyways, this guy, right? Mm -hmm. We were having a conversation. This nigga made me mad, right? Like... He was just doing too much dick eating. I don't really fuck with a dick eating. It's like, why are you eating my dick? You're supposed to be on my side. Mm -hmm. Type shit, like, right? Okay, before so, we continue, is this a nigga you fucking? <laughs> no, hashtag celibacy. Yeah. Why did you just lie to me, Lay? Like, what's up with you, bro? <laughs> Who's lying? Like, so you, you, you didn't fuck this nigga, Lay? Hell no. Nah. All right, cool. Continue. Now, anyways. Mm-hmm. Like I was saying, so it happened the, uh, oh yeah, the tenth. So um, Brody tried to call, Brody tried to call me, and I ignored the call because like, don't call me. You make mad, so don't call me. Like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> so anyway, so then um, what did you know, he do that made you mad? He was dicky in, but how? Like, like it was like, like. You know, like when you get in an argument with somebody and like somebody in the background like laughing or like you personally, I wouldn't take that. Just saying, like he instigated you. Yes, like stop <laughs> instigating. Like okay, you're supposed to be on my side. Okay, what are you doing? Okay, so he. So anyway, okay, yeah, he needs to stop trolling. Ain't nobody got time for that. Okay, I'm listening though. Be real. So anyway, nigga said. So me, me personally, I would take that, but I right, right, like boy, shut up. You personally, you would take it. The fuck? Who are you talking nah, to? No, anyways. Oh no, not you. Not oh, you. All right. Anyways, I'm listening though. Anyways, so um you start talking about bullshit, you know, like when guys like you know, like when they get to like, you know, saying stuff that girls want to hear, like, oh my god, like I would never like you're the only one, like uh uh hold on, let me go read it. <laughs> Why are you giggling, nigga? Because like, this is so funny. He said it's like at the end of the day. It's just you. Like, boy, please. Like, every time... How you I know you're not telling the truth? Time, Why are you assuming a nigga a liar? Let me tell you something, TK, right? Mm -hmm. Let me tell you something, right? Okay, like, how are you going to tell me, like, I'm the only one type shit, whatever, whatever. But every time somebody come around, you you get to ride in the dick. Like, what you mean? Maybe he's just a professional dick rider. He need to stop that. All if right. I'm the only one, why are you giving these hoes attention? Like... Okay, if it's let, let me be mm -hmm. let me be real with you here. All right, buddy. Go ahead. How is he giving hoes attention, baby? Oh my god! So look, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my god! So you know, like how you say, "Oh, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna beat you up when I see you." Like you know, damn well I'm not talking about fighting. <laughs> so you know, what I'm saying when you talking about that with another with another girl, like what am I supposed to think? Like oh, oh, so you finna lay that pipe on him? How you gonna say that to me and then say it to another feet? <laughs> Wait, he's telling bitches, "Oh, we finna, we finna fight when I see you." Like, yes. you playing? Like, oh, how you really, gonna, how you gonna like, say, that? Know, you like, say that? Nah, all right. I mean, nah, nah, nah. On a real note, though, he could just be playing, bro. Like, he just joking. It's just a little joke. Just a little jokey joke. Yeah, let me go tell. Let me go tell the nigga. Yeah, we gonna fight when I see you. That's crazy. I, you, well, I ain't gonna lie, I, know, lay. Yeah, well, I ain't gonna lie, lay. Be a good woman, bro. Stop the bullshit. I am a good woman. Nah. <laughs> I don't know. You talk. You you talking about some telling a nigga you we could fight when I see you. Don't listen. Don't piss me off, Lay. All right. Sorry. That's not real. You you bullshit. Sorry. But continue. I'm listening. But anyways, he was just like, yeah, you're the only one. Like, and then he was like talking about bullshit. Like, 
Tell myself, I would um, I would get in a relationship with you, but like, uh, tell myself, I'm adored by like like a lot of guys, and I'm like, bitch, what? Like, the hell you mean? Like, what they got to do with us? I'm adored <laughs> by a lot of guys. That's why. You yeah, me. You? I guess like a lot oh, of a lot you of you like, are ado- you, yeah, you like you got fans. Yeah, but like, uh, what I got to do with us? Like, these fans can't stop me from fucking you. What that's not like? <laughs> Hello. Whoa, whoa. whoa. Sorry, language. sorry. Okay. I'm just saying. Like, I'm just saying. Like, <laughs> what modern nigga says adored? You know she's from the 17th century. Her old proper ass. Anyways, listen. Um, bro. you're older than me. Whatever. By a lot. I almost called you son. Whatever, buddy. Um, now what I'm gonna say is he has valid reason. You got fans, nigga. You feel me? And all it take is one upset day for you to entertain one of them niggas, and now he can't eat for two weeks. So what I'm saying is. Just chill, bro. Like it ain't even that shish. You hear me? But look, like what the fuck? He said that's why. He said that's why he won't cuff you. Yeah. Alay, I ain't gonna lie to you. Mm -hmm. Tell me the truth. Did you let this nigga hit? No. So he's (laughs) never like you ain't get that no pussy. You ain't suck no No. dick nothing. No. All right. So what is you tripping about? I mean, you know. The day, the day was coming, but you know, I can't be with nobody that's that's telling other bitches they gonna fight them. But you out there, I mean, you can't. Maybe be he that just beating bitches ass because you he they talking crazy about you. You ever thought of that? Nah, be not nah, be for real. Nah, I'm being serious. Way. You ever thought of that? You always jump to the negative answer. Maybe he just be knocking bitches out because they talking crazy about you. Maybe he defending your honor. How you know? Yeah, yeah. I mean, let me go ahead and uh, tell a guy. Oh yeah, I'm gonna fight you when I see you. If a Maybe nigga, we all if, know if what a that nigga means. talking crazy about your nigga, you are not gonna slap him up. I mean, that's supposed to be your nigga job. Like, why am I fighting him for you? You a grown ass man. Like, but I mean, yeah, I would step in if he a little scared. Like, you know, grab a strap type shit. Lay, like, what is your problem, bro? <laughs> What's the issue here? What do you mean? What's my problem? What's your issue, bro? <laughs> like, like, look. What's the issue? If we <laughs> let me give an example. <laughs> All right, that's it. So say like, say like, like we getting ran on by the ops or something. What ops, and... Lay? You're from Indiana. <laughs> <laughs> Indiana. Just, just listen. All right. So You're let's from say I got fucking Nebraska, Lay. Please calm down. Nebraska. You live in Minnesota, yeah, just, nigga. Yes, I'm out here in Minnesota, but it don't like matter. what? I'm what saying, ops? Okay, so let's just say we was in the trenches or something. Like, can I just give my example? This you is are never example. in the trenches, bro. What are you talking about? You don't about know where right? I'm at. You don't I know, know where damn I'm well at. you're laid up in your two story home right now with your father and mother downstairs. Chilling. Just my mother. Okay. Hashtag real. Whatever. But anyway, I'm just giving an example. I didn't say this was my life. Okay. Now, anyways, now look. Yo, Tara, appreciate the 141 viewer raid. Shout out to you, Tara Blocks, Tara Blocks, Tara Blocks, W raid. Okay, so let's say I'm like, let's say like, let's say like, right? We in the curt and the nigga, you know what I'm saying? He he like, oh no, the ops is behind me type shit, and the strap me on my side. Like, I'm gonna blow. You feel me? You're but, not shooting at anything, bro. Bro, yes, I am, yo, bro. Like, bro, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, bro, bro, I, like, I'm finna tell you right now. <laughs> You're not shooting at anything, buddy. What do you mean? Like, I'm really letting that motherfucker talk boom. Like, I'm really like that. Like, you never know. Like, I'm about to kick you out of my Discord, bro. Cause <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You're sorry, chatting sorry. right now. You're yapping like, right now. But no, I'm serious. Like, look. Ask like, her about real. Shy. Who's Shy? Uh, the basketball player. Shy Gil, just Alexander. Oh, my God. Here's everything. Here, right? But we're not here for that. This is a therapy session, not me talking about. You know, my crush, like, what? Anyway, so, yeah, like, I just feel like, you feel me, like, if you really, if you really about me for real, if you really like me for real, why the fuck are you entertaining other females talking about something you're going to fight them when you see them? Or if like, you, you don't see that nigga fuck? Uh, I mean, Has he beat yet? <laughs> it depends. He ain't huh? fuck yet, right? No. So then why, who are you to tell that nigga who he can talk to and whatnot? Because why do you get mad at the fact that I'm being adored by other men or men is looking in my direction or men want to talk to me? When you out here, you know what I'm saying? Like, looking at any female that come your way, like, you're looking at anything that walk. Like, what, what's up? I don't do that. 
You feel me? If a nigga talk to me, you know, and I, I know I'm talking to somebody sometimes, I'm going to ignore them because like what? <laughs> Hello, I'm talking to somebody, but you can't seem to do the same. Like that just don't make no sense to me. Like you just yeah, every time you see a female, to. you you think you're Duke Dennis type shit. Like you are not Duke Dennis. Be yourself. Sound please. like you hating. Full hater. Don't care. Like what? Right, so How you gonna get mad at listen, me? Listen, buddy, I just don't support hating women. Let that man live his best life. When you're ready to be that nigga main chick, you'll step up. It sounds like you're not ready, okay? Oh my god! Like literally, I have stepped up for real. Like oh, why you ain't step up and get that nigga no pussy then? If you if you ready to uh, be his main chick, because they don't work like that. Wait, you think you're finna get something on the first link? Baby, nah. You think you better wait it out? You think that nigga finna be loyal on the first link? No. All right. Then. That's so why he ain't getting it about? on the first link. All right. So then, what you tripping about? <laughs> I ain't tripping. You is tripping. Okay. You ain't here complaining. You tripping. I'm not tripping. I, well, I am complaining, but, you know, I'm just saying, like, you can't really be like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like doing what? all that. You can't be doing all that and then, like, you know what I'm saying? Being my DMs talking about some crazy shit. Like, I just feel like type of shit, like. He being your DMs talking crazy shit? Hell yeah. He be sending like, you meat? Huh? He send you meat? No. Uh, nah, cool. That nah. too insane. Listen, let get that nigga some pussy or let him get it from the next bitch. Anyways, oh. you have a wonderful day. Uh. Okay, who else in this bitch? Talk to me, Bobby. Bobby. <sighs> Bobby. What the fuck? Hello? What is your profile picture, bro? Oh, you know Jadeon. It's you know that one Jadeon picture. It's a YouTube video. Oh, what's going on, though, Bobby? What's up, broski? Hey, good. TK. Um, what's up, though? My name is Bobby. Um, and I came to therapy session. And I want to talk about my eating addiction. You know, it's very... It's very bad. And I don't know how to, like... I'm trying to, like... I don't know. I just need to work on it. Because... Do you want the... Do you want, like, the, um... The overall stats? The what? Like, the, um... I like the player build. Nigga, is this like Javar, build. nigga? Javar. Hello? Javar. Nigga, I see your fucking no. name, nigga. I'm looking at it. It says timeout Javar, kick Javar, ban Javar, nigga. You not slick. No. I'm Do not gonna lie, bro. Listen, bro. Stop playing with me, little nigga. <laughs> nigga talking like a fucking gremlin. Get the fuck out of my ear with this bullshit, bro. What's wrong with nigga talking about some eating disorder? Put the fucking food down, fat ass. The fuck out my face. What's up, Give Give? Give Give. Give, give. Why is your profile picture I heart sluts? It, <clears throat> I don't really get females like that. You know, that's just a little a little thing I got going on. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Man. I'm listening. You ever deal with, like, stress, TK? Like, you feel like something just, like, weighing on you that you just need to get off your chest? But, like, you can't mm, say that shit for real. Yeah, like, what's going on, though? You know, I got this little situation, and basically, it's like, I got this girl, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I, I'm young, so, like, I don't really, like, want to cuff right off the bat. You know, I'm 20 years old, you know what mm -hmm, I'm saying? Cuffing, mm -hmm. cuffing a little scary, you know what I'm saying? Especially a nigga in college, you know what I'm saying? Want to venture out, find new things. Mm -hmm. So... You know, so I, you, I got you on your gay phase. Gay, gay phase. You said you want to try new things, like you experiment like, with your butt no, type no, shit. No, no, what? You said you trying I, to like try new shit, nigga. That's not, bro. That's not what I meant. But anyways, like it's it's like she, she you know, I'm getting pressured, you know, into her playing with your butt. What is wrong with you? I'm asking, nigga. <laughs> That's not what I'm talking about. What are you chatting about then? That's not what I'm talking about, bro. No, it's like, 
okay, so here's the situation. Okay. Um, you know, I, I'm free to be, you know, my own person. So mm-hmm. I do what I want. And I guess that individual feels like it's necessary for me to be gatekeeped. Okay. So she basically wants me to herself, but has lied about numerous amount of other things. Like niggas? That I'm worried about. You know what I'm saying? She be lying to you about niggas? Yeah. Okay. So, you know, I, I, I've I been finding out about a lot of bullshit, you know, in these past couple of, of months, you know, slowly by slowly. Okay. And so my, my motivation for the shit kind of like is dying down. And I don't, I don't, I don't really feel any, you know, I don't feel any just motivation to just cuff. So I left it alone, but it seemed like she just, she just mad at me for no reason. She's mad at you for no reason. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like she's but, mad because you won't cuff her. Did you fuck her already? No. You ate the pussy? No. Did she give you neck? <clears throat> so nah. she so no. Nah. Alright, so like you know why she like is mad. But it's like why? You know, I'm a s I'm I'm a single man, I feel like Cause but, she wants you, nigga. But it's like the signs are showing me not to do it. I mean, she's a she's you know, a wonderful you, you know, individual. My, all right, all right. Look, here's my best advice for you: fuck her first, and then see how it goes. Hit it once, and then if you're still not feeling it, don't do it. If you hit it and then you feel like she cool peoples, don't cuff her. But be like, yo, I feel like we working towards something, and I just want to take my time. Mm. She just sexually frustrated for real. But you wear a condom though, for sure. For but sure. do you feel? But you feel like it's justified for her to just blame me for every time I just try to. When was the last time a woman? Thing? When was the last time a woman took accountability for some shit not working out? Nigga, this is normal shit. You should know this that by right. now. Got that for me. Why are you surprised? I got bad trust issues. I feel it. That's why I never trust a bitch. Listen, only two things that's, or only three things that's guaranteed in this life. Taxes, death, and bitches choosing. Mm. Yeah, man. So, keep it player, bro. I had to tell a homie the other day, keep it player. Always keep it player. If you go into a situation with no expectations, you can't be hurt. You know what I'm saying? Javar, I see you changing your fucking name in here. Stop changing your name and your fucking picture, nigga. You're not catching me with that shit. Anyways, look, bro. Um, hit it first though. Like, really beat the doonies down, and then leave her alone. That's how mm-hmm. you really know. If she get crazy, then yeah, I mean, you kind of. What if the bro. crazy shit already started? Oh, then you gotta knock it down now, cause that pussy probably fire. Like the the you know the constant threats. She be threatening you. Yeah, a lot. Like what? A lot. Like how? Like, <laughs> like, like threatening to kill me on some shit. Mm. In GTA. Mm. Yeah, she know where I reside. So like, she ain't really <clears> trying to kill you. Just give her some dick. She'll be straight. I'm not trying to get stabbed, TK. You won't get stabbed, bro. Is she a uh, melanated queen? Yeah. All that shit be good, bro. All that shit be cool, bro. She just chatting. She just love you. Love? Yeah, she in love with you, bro. The big ass word. Yeah, man. You gotta, you gotta dick it down first. Hmm. And when I say lay the pipe, I mean like look her in her eyes type pipe. 
You know what I mean, not no weak shit. Like really, that's give a, it to but me, that's bro. the type of that's that's the type of shit that's gonna make her be obsessed with me. I ain't exactly. trying to have that though, right? And now when she's obsessed, that's when you leave. Oh, that kind of <laughs> that's kind of crazy. You know what I mean? After you hit it like that, that's when you be like, yo. The energy you was giving me just wasn't for me, bro. And I think that we really should go our separate ways. Mm. Give, give. I'm telling you, it's for the best. Because now she's going to go on a downward spiral of trying to fill that hole in her heart with other niggas. And before she knows it, she's pregnant. And you just dodged a bullet. Sometimes you got to destroy to create, bro. If you want to create happiness for yourself, destroy hers. Mm. Real shit. It's how it is, man. It's how it is. But anyways, man, thanks for listening. Um, let me know how that go. Yeah, I needed that. Yeah, for sure. Tap in. Matter of fact, call her right now. For sure. Call her right now. On on stream? Yeah, right now, bro. <clears throat> she might be at work, bro. She gonna answer if she really fuck with you. I'm not trying to hear them. Uh, I'm not trying to hear that hang up shit. You know what I'm saying? Why are you afraid, bro? And My bad. She, you, know what, you know what? Here, call her and she don't answer. Be like, wow. So I guess you really don't fuck with me because I could have been dying. I really needed you. You wasn't there for me. Boom. And then she gonna be like, what do you mean? What do you mean? And then just don't talk to her for the rest of the week. And you chilling. Listen, this is a win-win situation because either she answers and you see what you can get off. Or she don't answer, and now you have a reason to cut her off. You ready? Call her, bro. <sighs> oh, hold on. Wrong number. She bangs your shit. I'm saying, bro, I don't got motion like that. Call twice. Now y'all just like. Nah, you don't gotta call twice. But I, I would text and be like, "Damn, you can't answer when I need you." I can't deal with somebody who's not really like you know what I mean. I feel it. <sighs> yeah, now you have a reason to uh drop it, buddy. Congratulations. I just saved you. There you go. You have a good night. Two. Mm. 